Hello. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and are ready to start some yoga with Lenny and I. That was like perfect timing from this little guy. He's also kind of in crazy mode, so he'll probably try to bite me at some point. Um, if you guys notice, I have changed my setup a little bit. I didn't really like having all of the plants just in the corner. So hopefully this is a a little bit more welcoming of a setup. Um, glad I've got a couple people jumping on. Good morning. I hope you're ready to do some yoga with me. Go ahead, get your water. Take a big drink right now. Stay hydrated. Set your mat up if you haven't already. We're going to jump into some yoga in just a second. Now's a great time. Go ahead and start your watch if that's what you like to do. <clears throat> and get ready for a little bit of energy this morning. So I want you to come onto your mat, just face in the camera. We're going to start standing today. So first just get a little rock side to side. You can get your head involved, loosening up that neck. Start to get your arms involved. Really become free, like a rag doll with your body. And then we're going to start to move into some twists. All right, so just taking your arms from one side to the other. And keep your feet grounded, so now you're just twisting through that torso. And really start to feel that spin. Be gentle, you don't want to throw your arms to the back wall, because you could hurt something throughout your chest. You don't want to do that. <clears throat> and then slowly come back to center. Take a breath in, standing up nice and tall. Inhale, and exhale. Great, I want you to go ahead and just get a little kind of pep in your step, I would say. All right, we're gonna open up our lymphatic system, so the more you start to shake and move and bounce, you're getting your lymphatic system going which is ultimately helping you stay a healthier individual. So shake your arms left and right. You can start to bounce off the floor or side to side. Just find what feels good for you. Try not to step on your animals because, you know, he conveniently placed himself right there. And find your stillness, standing up nice and tall, tailbone under, eyes closed. Pull that chin to the back wall. Open your palms to the wall in front. Take a big inhale in and out. One more, just like that. Inhaling in and out. Great. Go ahead and step to the front of your mat. Bring your feet close together. They don't have to be zipped up. Take a big inhale in and out. Inhale, sweep those arms all the way up to the ceiling. Exhale, we're going to forward fold, sending that upper body over your lower body. Just release your neck here. Allow your head to dangle. And just focus on that breath. Inhaling in and out. And with that next inhale, glide your hands all the way up to your thighs, straighten through your legs, straighten through your upper body, halfway lift. Take a big inhale in, and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, bring your hands to your shins this time. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Go ahead and bend your knees, and slow and steady, roll all the way back up to standing. Straightening through your legs, Tucking that tailbone under, roll, rounding up through the low back, mid back, upper back. Loop those shoulders back and down your spine. Take a big inhale and open those palms to the wall in front. Let it go. Bend your knees, drop your hands down, draw a big circle up and overhead. Slight back bend at the top and exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Exhale, palms together right to your heart. Just focus on your breath here for a moment. Great. 
you inhale, bend those knees, drop your hands, big circle all the way up. Exhale, forward fold, plant those palms, step one foot back, and then the other. We're shifting into plank. You can always come onto your knees if that's what's available to you. Take a big inhale in, and as you exhale, keep your elbows into your side. We're going to slowly lower all the way down, moving through our first vinyasa. Bring that belly to the ground, uncurl your toes. Inhale, just lift your head, chin, and chest off the mat. Exhale, lower your head down. Inhale, press through your hands, lengthen through your arms, lift your entire upper body off the mat, upper dog. And exhale, curl your toes under, send your hips to the sky, downward facing dog. Pull your chest towards your thighs here. Bring your ears right in between your biceps and tuck those shoulder blades down your back. Focus on your breath, inhaling in and out. You can have a slight bend in your knees if that's more comfortable to you. Don't try to straighten through your legs just yet. We're getting warmed up here. Inhale, bend your knees, send your gaze forward, step or walk all the way to the front of your mat. Forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Go ahead and take your hands onto your big toes here. Send your elbows as wide as the room. Let your head go. Just hang here. Feel your arms pulling your upper body farther down. Inhale, lengthen. Keep your hands on your toes. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Release your toes. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Palms together right at your heart. Take a breath here. Inhaling in. In and out. Inhale, bend those knees, drop your hands down, big circle, all the way up. Exhale, send your hands all the way to the floor, palms down, step it back. We're going to move through our vinyasa, inhaling into plank or lowered plank. Exhale, all the way down. Inhale into up dog. And this time, open your knees as wide as your mat, send your big toes into touch, send your hips to your heels. Coming into child's pose. Relax your forehead all the way down to the mat. And just take a breath here. We come to this pose to help us lower our heart rate, return our breath to normal, and to develop our gratitude practice. So while we're here, eyes closed, I want you to bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one thing that you're grateful for from this morning. With that next inhale, find your flow all the way up into a tabletop. We're going to bring our knees underneath of our hips, our wrists right under our shoulders. Press up through your hands here. Send your gaze just out in front of your nose. Take a big inhale in and out. Inhale, drop that belly down. Send your hips to the sky. Look forward. Don't crane your neck back here though. Exhale, pull your belly all the way to the ceiling. Tuck your chin into your chest. Tuck your tailbone under. Inhale, lengthen. Drop that belly. Exhale, round. Chin to chest. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, round. We'll do two more. Last one. Great. Inhale, come back into our neutral spine here. You're going to step one foot back, then the other, shifting into plank, keeping those wrists right under your shoulders, inhaling in. Pull your core into your spine. Tone through your body here. You're going to hold it here for three more breaths. You can do it. 
Don't let yourself fall into those shoulders. Press up and away. One more breath. Great. Inhale. Send your hips all the way up to the sky. Downward dog. Pull your chest towards your thighs here. Loop those shoulders back and down your spine so we don't have any compression in our shoulders. I want you to go ahead and anchor through that left heel, dropping it down to the mat. Sweep your right toes off the mat as high as you can without stacking your hips. We want to keep our hips parallel to the ground. Three-legged dog. Take a big inhale in. And as you exhale, we're going to shift into plank. Pull that knee into your chest. Step it in between your hands or as close as you can get. Stay on the ball of that back foot now. Take a big inhale in. Send your chest forward. And exhale. Inhale, plant that left palm. Send your right arm all the way up to the sky. Don't let that back knee drop down unless you need it to. Pull your leg towards the ceiling here. You can always take that arm onto your hip, pulling that top shoulder to the back wall. Big breath in. And out. One more inhale, just like that. Let it go. Send that right hand down on the outside of that right foot, coming onto the fingertips. Inhale, open that left arm to the ceiling. Focus on your breath here. Notice if that back leg dropped. Send it up. Just focus on those inhales. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Great. Go ahead and release that left hand down. We're going to step that left foot up to meet your right. Forward fold. Inhale, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Palms together, bring them to the heart for a breath. It's a great time to fix all of your clothes. <laughs> Take a big inhale and lift those arms all the way up to the sky. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, look forward, lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant those palms. Step your opposite foot back this time and then the other and move through your vinyasa. And you can choose to take a child's pose or a down dog here. You're in child's pose. Bring your forehead all the way down to the mat. Close your eyes and just focus on that breath. And if you're in down dog, I want you to drop one heel and then the other, really just lengthening through the back sides of your legs. Use your breath as a guide. One more breath here. And everyone, find your flow all the way up to a plank position. Inhaling in. And out. Inhale, take that right knee to your right elbow. Exhale, send it back. Inhale, left knee, left elbow. Exhale, send it back. Inhale, right. Send it back. Inhale, left. Keep it going. Two more each side. Don't fall into those shoulders. Last set. Keep your hips nice and stable. And send it up into down dog. Inhaling in. And out. Go ahead and plant that right heel this time. Send your left toes off the floor as high as you can. Inhaling in. And out. Inhale, bend that knee, shift into plank. Step that left foot in between your hands. Inhale, lengthen through your chest, look forward. And exhale. I'm gonna come onto the right fingertips this time. Inhale, open that left arm to the sky. Keep that back knee lifted, or if you need a break, set it on the ground. You can come down, palm on the floor, that right hand if you need to. Should be feeling the heat coming into your body at this point. Take a big inhale in. Exhale. Send that left hand down. Open that right arm to the sky. 
Focus on your breath here. Lift that back leg off the mat. Send those hips a little higher. Inhaling in. And exhale. Bring that right hand down. Step that right foot up to meet your left. Forward fold. Just allow your head to release here. Focus on your breath. Inhale, lengthen, look forward, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen, look forward. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle, all the way up. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle. Hands to your heart for one breath. And then go ahead and step to the center of your mat facing your screen. Smile if you haven't already. Take a big inhale and stand up nice and tall. And exhale, let it go. Go ahead and step your feet as wide as you can on that mat. Inhale, send those arms up and overhead. Exhale, send your hips to the back wall. Sink forward, forward fold, standing wide legs. Drop that head down. Inhale, press your fingertips into the floor. Lengthen, look forward, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. See if you can inch your feet a little wider here, releasing your head even closer to the floor. If you can't, do not strain. This is not an audition. Do what your body is capable of, and in time, you'll be able to get there. Inhale, lengthen, look forward. Exhale, bring your feet back in just slightly. And we're gonna walk our hands to the right, lengthen through that left leg, get a little squat in your right leg here. Inhale, walk yourself to the opposite side, straighten through the right leg this time. Get a nice stretch through the inside of our legs here. Keep that going. Inhale one side, let that air out, and then walk yourself to the opposite side, keeping your foot planted on the floor as we move. Do one more each side. <clears throat> Come back to center, send your hips to the sky. Let your head come all the way down. Inhale, lengthen, look forward. Bring your hands onto your hips, bend those knees, roll all the way up to standing here. Go ahead and turn your toes to the right side of your mat. We're gonna come onto the ball of that back foot. Inhale, lengthen through that upper body. Notice if you're letting your hips go to that back wall, tuck your tailbone under. Step your feet in a little closer if you need to. Keep that front leg straight for now. And then inhale, dive it down, get a bend in that front leg. Inhale, send those arms up and overhead. Exhale, release those hands down. Inhale, lengthen through that front leg as you lift your arms this time. And exhale, sink it all back down. Create a nice flow with your breath, with your body. Inhaling in, and out, sinking it down. Inhale, and exhale. Great, stay here lowered, and now I want you to dip that back knee just to touch the mat. Inhale, bring it up, exhale, sink it down. Inhale up, exhale, down. Keep it going. And really get the heat going in our body this morning. You're welcome, and I'm sure you hate me at the same time. I'm okay with that. I'm a middle school teacher. I'm pretty used to that. We'll do two more. Last one. Great, go ahead and lower that back heel down, sending that foot at an angle. Open your arms as wide as your mat. Look over your front fingers. Get a nice deep bend in that front knee. Keep your knee in line with that ankle though. Pull your pinkies to the back wall here. Focus on your breath. Any shoulder issues at any time, you can always bring your hands down to your hips. Roll that tailbone under. And 
with that next inhale release that back hand down the back thigh send your front hand up to the sky you can either straighten through that front leg or sink it down totally up to you here there's so many variations in all yoga poses which means you can find exactly what your body needs with that next breath you're going to bring that right forearm on top of your right thigh send your left hand up to the sky side angle pose Pull that top shoulder to the back wall here. Focus on your breath. Notice if you're lifting in that front leg, you should probably be feeling a bird in your thighs. It's okay. One more big inhale here. And exhale, cartwheel your hands down to your mat, plant those palms. Step your foot back, move through your vinyasa, shifting into plank, and then slowly lowering. And everyone, go ahead and take a child's pose. You earned it. Send your hips to your heels. Bring that forehead down to the floor. And just breathe. You can keep your arms extended out in front, or you can pull them back towards your head and shoulders here. Find what's comfortable for you. right at my nose. You guys know how annoying that is. <laughs> All right, so focus on your breath. Big inhale in. And exhale, let it go. Allow your heart rate to come down. You're probably feeling really warm right now. Isn't that how you want to start your day? Warm and energized and ready to just move with success through your day? I mean, come on, how awesome does that sound? If you're not smiling already from my cheesiness, go ahead and bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. With that next inhale, find your flow all the way up to your version of plank. Inhaling in and out. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, we're just going to tap that right knee down to the mat. Slow and steady, bring it back up. Don't have too much of a wobble in your hips. Inhale, left leg down, send it up. Keep it going, one side to the other. I promise we won't be here for long. Stay pushing out of those shoulders, belly button into your spine, hips nice and stable. One more each side. Last one. Great, send your hips to the sky, downward dog. Take a breath here, in through the nose, and out. Go ahead and bend your knees, look forward, walk or step all the way to the front of your mat. Come into your forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, big circle all the way up. Palms together, bring them to the heart. Take a breath, big inhale in. Exhale, let it go. Go ahead and step yourself to the center of your mat, and you guessed it, send your legs wide again. Inhale, arms all the way up to the sky, and exhale, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, fold. With that next inhale, we're going to walk our hands to the right, lengthen through that left side. Get a nice bend in your right knee over here. And then walk yourself to the opposite side. Try to keep a nice straight line in your upper body. You don't want to just collapse here and move very not gracefully. Let's 
keep it going one side to the other following your breath I'm sure you're feeling a shake in your legs that's okay it means you're gonna get stronger we'll do one more each side come back to center and forward fold inhale lengthen exhale fold go ahead and bring your hands onto your hips give yourself a little bend in those knees round all the way up to standing take a breath there fix your clothes how do they move so much you guys go ahead and point your toes to the left side this time we're going to come up onto the ball of that back foot again tuck your tailbone under you have a straight leg for now in that front leg and then when you're ready, <coughs> let's crack. We're gonna bend that front leg. Take a big inhale in, lift those arms. Yeah, exhale, sink them down. This time, get your body involved. Inhale, lift those arms, lengthen through that front leg. And exhale, send it down. Keep it going. Use your breath as a guide. We're getting in all of this amazing oxygen. We're gonna send it through our entire body into those muscles into your organs and you're just gonna feel like a friggin awesome human when we're done two more just like this last one hold it when you come down you can bring your hands onto your hips and when you're ready we're gonna tap that back knee down inhale lift it up exhale tap keep it going should be getting warm Feeling a shake in your legs, I know I am. We'll do two more. Last one. Great, go ahead and plant that back heel down, slight angle with that foot, get a nice bend in that front knee, open your arms as wide as your mat, warrior two. Tuck your tailbone down towards the ground. Pull your pinkies to the back wall here. Notice if you're lifting in that front leg, sink it back down. And just focus on your breath. Imagine that you're standing between two planes of glass. You are in this nice perfect line with your entire body. With that next inhale, drop your back hand down the back thigh, send your left hand to the sky. You can either look forward, or out to the side, whatever is comfortable for your neck here. If you came up in that front leg, sink it back down. Focus on your breath, big inhale in. Exhale, drop that left forearm on top of the left thigh. Open your right arm to the sky this time. Again, drop yourself in your hips, not yourself. That would not be good. <clears throat> Focus on your breath here. Big inhale in. And exhale, release those hands down to the floor. Plant your palms, step that foot back through your vinyasa. And go ahead and take a child's pose. Pull your hands back towards your shoulders here. And just allow your breath to stabilize. Hopefully you're feeling warm at this point. Take one big inhale in through the nose and let it go. One more just like that, really big. Let it out. Great. Go ahead and bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for, but this time be extra specific.
with our next inhale. If your hands are not under your shoulders, bring them there now. Press yourself up away from your mat. Bring your knees into center and just sit back onto your heels. Sit up nice and tall in your body here. Pull your chin towards that back wall, bringing your ears right over your shoulders. Take a big inhale in and out. And just stay here for a couple breaths. I want you to roll your tailbone under here. Pull your belly button into your spine. It's going to feel uncomfortable because we're not used to moving our body in this way. Big inhale in. And exhale, let it go. And that next breath. I want you to send your body forward. Curl your toes under here. And slow and steady, send your hips back towards your heels. We're going to get a nice stretch through the bottom of your foot. So really, really be careful in this pose. You might start to burn. You're not used to bending and flexing your feet in this way. But dang it, you guys, these things take us through our entire day. I don't know if you know this, but like hundreds of pounds rely on these feet. So take care of them, right? Our hands and our feet, we neglect them the most. They do everything for us. So again, sit up nice and tall. Pull your body back in space, way more than you would think. Pull your chin towards that back wall or take your right hand to your chin, press it back in space. And just focus on your breath here. Big inhale in and out. You won't be here for much longer, I promise. Just breathe. Great. Send your body weight forward. Bring your palms down to the floor. We're going to step back. Our left leg, curl your toes under. Kind of come into a slight plank, but we're not going to. We're going to take that right knee to our right elbow and then your right ankle to your left uh, did I say elbow? I totally meant wrist. Go ahead and lower that back leg down. Uh, uncurl your toes. Inhale, come onto your fingertips. Press through, lengthen through that upper body. We did a lot of leg work today, so we're going to give them a little extra love with stretching. So with your next breath, you can stay right here if you need to, or you can slowly come down onto your forearms. If you have a block, you can put it underneath of your head. You can stack your fists to do that as well, to make sure you're getting a nice flex in that right foot so we can protect that right knee. Or if it's available to you, bring your head all the way down to the floor and just relax here. Don't do anything that feels like you're straining, you're causing yourself to have extra tension. Just come up and out of the pose just slightly. Keep your shoulders down away from your ears. Just focus on your breath. Find one thing to hold your gaze. And notice where you're holding in that tension. And just let it go. Right? We move our body. We build this heat. We build, you know, this friction and tension to ultimately let it go. To expel it from our body. Because it doesn't serve us. There's no purpose for it. Other than making us feel like shit. And I don't know about you, but I want to feel good. <laughs> One more really big inhale in and out. Slow and steady, walk your hands back to the mat, press into your fingertips here, lengthen through that upper body. Go ahead and curl those back toes under, come onto your palms, lift that back knee, send your right leg to the back wall, replace it with that left. So lower your right knee this time, uncurl your toes. <clears throat> inhale, lengthen, look forward. And exhale, release yourself down. You might find that one leg is a little bit more uh, tender than the other. Just listen to your body. If you have to come up and out of a pose on one side versus the other, it's okay. We are not equal from side to side, front to back, right? So we adjust as needed, listen to what our body needs, and then we breathe. Make sure you're keeping your ears away from your shoulders here. You can close your eyes if you'd like. And again, notice where you're 
holding in that tension. Just let it go. Next breath, go ahead and bring your hands down to the floor, lengthen through, come up in that chest. And then we're going to drop that left hip down towards the mat, slow and control, and sweep your right leg out in front of you. Bring your legs straight down to the floor. You can pull the flesh of your buttocks out to the side so you can bring your sit bones all the way down. Bring your hands right down to the mat, right at your hips. Sit up nice and tall. <clears throat> Bring your chin back in space. Take a big inhale in. And out. Inhale, sweep those arms up to the sky. Exhale, fold over your legs, catching wherever it's comfortable. Maybe it's your shins, maybe it's your ankles. In time, you'll be able to grab the bottoms of your feet. And then just relax your head down. Tuck that chin into your chest. Keep those shoulders away from your ears. <clears throat> Drop them down your spine. And just focus on your breath here. Inhale, release that upper body nice and straight. And then as you exhale, pull that left heel into your right thigh. Flex your right toes. Inhale, send your fingers all the way up to the sky. Exhale, fold over your right leg this time. Tuck your chin into your chest. And just breathe. Inhale, roll all the way back up. We're going to switch legs. <coughs> Pulling that right heel into your left thigh this time. Flex your left toes. Inhale, lift through those arms. Exhale, fold. Tuck your chin into your chest here. in that upper body, sitting up nice and tall. Extend your legs out in front of you. Give them a little shimmy shake. Shift your hips forward just slightly. Bring the bottoms of your feet down to the mat. Take a big inhale and bring your palms out in front of you, open to the ceiling. Make sure we're sitting up nice and tall here. You don't want to round in your spine. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bring it back just slightly. Inhale, palms together out in front. And then we're going to send our arms up to the sky. Exhale, drop them down. Inhale, up. Exhale, over to the right. Inhale, up. Exhale, to the left. Pet a cat if you got one. Inhale, up. Exhale, back. Bring them up to center. Send your upper body towards the sky. Getting a little pulse here. Use your breath. Pull your belly button into your spine. Inhale, hold it at the top. Exhale, slow and steady. Release yourself all the way down to the floor. Bring those arms up and overhead. You can stretch through those legs if you need to. Get a big stretch. Yawn if you've got it. And exhale, bring your hands down to your hips. Pull your knees into your chest. Give them a little tug here. Lift that tailbone up off the mat. Plenty of being a little distracting, you guys. <laughs> take a big inhale in. Exhale, release that left leg down. We're gonna take your left hand onto your right knee, send your right palm to the floor, and then lean over, don't crush your cat. <laughs> take that right knee to the left side. Focus on your breath here. Inhaling in. And out. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, roll yourself back to center. Both knees into your chest. Release that left palm down, right leg down. And send your left leg to the right side. Look over to your left hand here. 
focus on your breath. <laughs> Sorry, Lenny's getting playful. It's hard to relax when he's about to attack you. <laughs> Inhale, come back to center, knees into your chest. Give them a tug this time. And then when you're ready, release one leg and then the other. You can have your hands on your body or just let them fall to the ground in a nice comfortable way. Go ahead and close your eyes. Take a big inhale in through the nose. Let it go through the mouth. Inhaling in. Exhale, let it go. One more just like that, in. And out. And just allow yourself to lay here, just focusing on our breath, coming in and out of the nose. Letting your body just completely relax into your mat. Being still, being present, just breathe. Next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingertips, bat your eyelashes open and closed a few times. And when you're ready, roll onto your side facing me, using your arm as a pillow, and we'll take a breath there. Inhaling in, and out. Inhale, press yourself away from the floor, come into a nice cross-legged position, sitting up nice and tall, eyes closed, hands in your lap. Take a big inhale in and out. Bring your palms together right up to your forehead, inhaling in and out. Be kind in your thoughts to yourself and others. Bring your hands down to your lips. Take a big inhale in and out. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. Just breathe. Bring your hands down to your heart center. Take a big inhale in and out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Take one more big inhale in and exhale, bow forward. Namaste. Oh, thank you guys for joining this morning. I hope you uh, made it through this entire energizing flow. I know it was uh, burning for me too. So I'm proud of you for showing up, for committing to this time and space to improve yourself and also just take your focus on all of the stuff that's going on in the world. So um, again, this is always a donation based. If you feel inspired from doing this live with me, then anything that you can give is always appreciated. There's links to Venmo and PayPal in the announcements of the group. So 
yeah, with that, I will see you guys soon. I hope you have an awesome day. Stay hydrated, be good humans, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.